Hello YouTube, this is Apple Tech, and today I got the new Reminders Beta 4.5. Now in this video, I'm just going to show you the new things on Reminders Beta 4.5. So the link will be in the description. You can download it, transfer it to iTunes, and sync it into your device. Make sure you have AppSync again for your iPhone or iPod. So as you can see, when you first get into Reminders, it doesn't start with the Reminders you can see that it actually you can scroll through it like the real reminders you can scroll and it's really cool how they added the scrolling effect now on this completed you can not tap on this it's um, not working and as you can see in the reminders there's a couple new things so I'm just gonna quickly go through them right here when you tap on it you know you can type something in and right after you type something in so say if I wanted that and you click done it disappears so that's a bug that it has but as you can see, if I exit the device and there's nothing running in the background, and you can see if I go back into it and I swipe to the side, you can see that my whatever I typed in is still there. So it does work, but it's still a little buggy. Now another cool thing is that in the other betas, when you click this, it didn't do nothing. But as you can see, if I click on it, you can actually save it. So you can just pick a date and the time and you, all you have to do these these don't work up here so see if I click it um, if I click these two and I try to close it I can't close it so I advise you not to click on that so the only way to close the keyboard is to click done which exits you out so the best thing to do is to click on this and just to add a date and a time and just click tap to save and as you can see the reminders has saved and it's right there and all you have to do is dismiss and then click done. Now as you can see, whatever I write is still there. So the saving is working, but it's still a little buggy. Now as I said in the last beta, these checks right here don't appear, but you can click on the side of the arrows and then the checks will appear. So if you click right here, it says reminders beta 4.5. So you know what beta it is. Now another bug that it has is if you click on this second one, you can see how it says done right there. So this actually goes down. But if you click on this fourth one, you can see that it doesn't say done. So you can't close it down. You can text something, but there's no closing. If you flip to the back, it still doesn't have the white door thing. And it, everything's the same. It scrolls. Um, when you click on it, you have to click this button to search. So the back's the same. And the front, you see how this keyboard doesn't close? So that's a bug that it really has. You see, it, the word's actually typed in. When I typed it, it actually types in, but it doesn't click done so that's one bug that it has say if I exit it there's no apps right in the background like I said and then I click on the reminders so as you can see if I swipe right here the bottom one doesn't say just these top ones so it's kind of really buggy then again it still has this reminder swipe which is really cool so that's a new thing added to the reminders app and then the same thing goes with the date up here you can switch it it's nothing works still you can click on it but none, none of this works so that's Reminders Beta 4. Please leave any of your comments, questions below. Tell me what you think. If Do you like this beta? Don't you? Please like the video down there. So this is Apple Tech signing out. Peace out. See you in the next beta.